Monday. So it's Monday today. I'm off. So I'm getting ready. I got a bunch of stuff that I'm doing today. I'm just starting off by putting um, the, I'm starting dinner. So I'm making a slow a crock pot meal i'm gonna make a roast and i ended up getting the slow cooker kit i normally don't get this i normally would get um normally i get it separate and buy everything but i'm like let me go ahead and just try this i think this whole thing together was like 17 dollars, so that's a good deal you know you get everything that you need that you like for your roast so i'm gonna go ahead and start it i'm gonna put this in the crock pot season my meat and then i'll put my veggies in a little bit later so i'll update you guys I'm not dressed yet, but once I get dressed, I make a little bit of, of a late breakfast. All right, you guys, so I'm back home. I just ran a couple of errands. I got dinner on, the crock pot's been on about, what, maybe two hours now. And I ran to Dollar General because we needed a couple things, some more paper plates and stuff, but I also picked up some other stuff. So I figured I'll do a quick haul for you guys. So first, like I said, I picked up some paper cups and plates. I won't show you guys that. Paper cups, paper bowls, and cups. And then I also picked up another 10 pack of the Starbucks caramel flavored coffee K cups. These were really, really good. When I picked these up last time, if you guys watched that haul, these were super duper good. I got some more carpet freshener, and I usually get the Armin, um, I usually get the Armin Hammer one, but I decided to just go ahead and get the Glade one. This is the one that my mom usually gets in clean linen. It smells really, 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 really good. But this is the pet one, just a clean scent. It smelled really, really good. I love to use like carpet fresheners when I vacuum. I think it makes such a big difference and it really does leave the house fresh. I picked up another thing of mouthwash. I got the Crest Scope. Um, this is just the classic. This is just the classic. So I picked up one of those. We also needed some more toner. So I picked up this Dickinson's Enhanced Witch Hazel uh, Daily Use Hydrating Toner with um, rose water. And this is alcohol free. So I picked that up and we also needed some more cotton rounds. So I picked up another pack by Studio Perfect to put in our little, uh, the little acrylic dispenser that we have. I picked these up and this is the Easy On Skin Stridex uh, Sensitive. Uh, this is the Stridex pads. It's a salicylic acne medication pad that you can cleanse your face with. It has 0.5% salicylic acid. They had a red one. And I, they had another color. It just depends on the level of salicylic acid that you're looking for. So, yeah, pick that up. And this one is for sensitive skin with aloe. And I thought that would be really interesting to try out. So, yeah, I'm excited to try those. I also found this, which I thought was super interesting. I love ginger ale. That's one of my favorite sodas. And I, got, I found these sugar-free on-the-go ginger ale... Um, powder mixes and they only have obviously no sugars uh, no fat and there's only 10 calories which is really nice because an actual can of ginger ale still has like 70 or 90 calories i think it is so this is actually really not that bad so hopefully they're good just gives me another good healthy alternative also i did try out i don't know if i told you guys that i got these pepsi zeros um sugar sugar free and it was really really good um so i've been drinking those and it also helps me not run through soda so quickly because i feel like sometimes i have a tendency to do that um but okay look a couple more things i also picked up i needed some more eco styling gel i usually get the olive oil one but this is the only one that they had in stock and this is the black castor and flaxseed oil last two things were just two more items to add to my friend my bridesmaid siobhan one of my really really good friends she's pregnant you guys and i think i told you guys that she's due coming up here really soon so i've been putting together her a nice little baby shower basket so i just picked up these two items which are a hooded towel and four washcloth set which i thought would be really cute with a comb and a brush i thought that was super cute and then i also picked up these dr brown pacifiers just a two-pack because you can never have enough of stuff like that. So I'm doing her like a nice little cute basket. Of course, I'll show you guys how everything looks. But that's pretty much it, you guys. I'm just getting ready to put everything up. Just wanted to show you guys everything. Um, I'm going to do some laundry. I'm going to vacuum now and just kind of straighten up. And that's it. So I'll check in with you guys a little bit later. Uh
this so it's later on it's actually about 4 30 now i'm home from work and i just kind of been sitting here honestly relaxing um i ate my soup um uh, the chef at the cook at our job she makes this really good like broccoli soup it's not even broccoli cheddar soup it's literally just broccoli soup like a cream of broccoli soup or something but it's so good especially with like a little sandwich mm. It'd be so good. So anyway, she knows that's like my favorite soup. And she knew it was like my first day coming back. So I'm like, oh, she made me some soup and packed it to go. So I had me some soup when I got home. And I just been kind of sitting here relaxing. Um, and that's pretty much it, y'all. Um, as you guys can see, my hair, I don't know what I'm going to do, but I need to moisturize it today. I might try a style. I'm going to show you guys. Um, I'll let you guys know, but... Today was an okay day at work, you guys. Honestly, it was pretty annoying because um, I had to train, like I told you guys earlier. So it was just a day of ta a lot of talking um, and just, it's just a lot. When you're training in healthcare, like it's, it's, it's a lot. And then it's like, you know, you gotta be nice. It just takes a lot of strength. Not like that I'm mean or anything, but it takes a lot of energy because you have like pretty much a shadow the entire day. Um, so yeah, y'all, that's that, but it was pretty good. Nonetheless, she was a really nice, sweet girl. So we'll just leave it at that. You guys, not much going on tonight. Um, I'm making us tacos for dinner and then I watched Hannah Olivia's vlog so I really want a taco salad she did some taco salad meal prep and it looked so good so I think I'll probably pack me a taco salad to make to bring me to work tomorrow <laughs> about 12 30 it's lunchtime um today's what today's wednesday so happy hump day day's going pretty well i'm on assisted living today so i've actually had a pretty easy day lots more meds lots of vitals to do but it's been a pretty smooth day i'm just in my car right now I'm about to eat my lunch really quick and I wanted to update you guys. I tried bought one of those uh, ginger ale sugar drinks. Disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. Um, but I'm just about to eat my lunch really quick. We so yeah, that's what I'm eating. Just some chili and a corn muffin. That's for lunch today. So we pretty much um, get the option to eat. Like at my job, I know everybody's job is different depending on where you work. If it's a hospital, facility, and each facility is pretty much different. Um, nursing homes, hospitals, everybody's different. Sometimes you have to pay. Sometimes there's like you pay a discounted price for the lunches. But one of the benefits of, our, of my job is that we do get to eat a free meal every day. We do get a free lunch. And you can always get the hot lunch that the residents are eating. Otherwise, she always does like a soup. You can always order a sandwich. You can always order a, a, sa a salad every day. Um, and she usually does like a substitute for the main meal. So we have a couple of different options of what we can eat every single day. So that's really nice. But yeah, that ginger ale sugar-free drink mix was not good. Not good at all. I got me some normal ice water in my little thing here. And yeah, my co-partner on my floor, she leaves at one o'clock, so I wanted to make sure that I ate 
beforehand. Because then I'll be responsible for the whole floor. And I got my walk in case any of my lights go off. So that's it, you guys. That's all I really wanted. Just to kind of come on, check in, let you guys know how the day is going. We got about two hours left. Two hours and 15 minutes left of today's shift. So, yeah. Good morning, you guys. Happy Thursday. So, we're heading to work. And it is early, it's 6.23 this morning. And yeah, I'm heading to work. And today is my Friday. So I'm really excited because then it's my weekend off. But I do work um, on the 4th, which is Sunday. Because <clears throat> um, it's my holiday. We alternate holidays. So even though it's my weekend off, if your holiday falls on a day that you don't work, you still work. And if it's not a holiday that you normally work, and um you're scheduled you don't you're not you would normally work you don't normally work so it's all good with me you guys i'm not tripping because it's literally all going to be um overtime i'm in holiday pay so and it'll be done early like we're not going to be doing anything early i don't know exactly what we're doing for the fourth just yet um <clears throat> we were just talking about how we probably are going to cook ourselves because we haven't we usually don't do anything for the fourth we'll just go around and you know people or our family are cooking or whatever so anyways y'all we going to work i got this my iced coffee i'm training again so i figured i would come on here this morning and talk to you guys because i don't know if i'll be able to do a lot of filming today at work but yeah hey guys all right so i just came back from it's like 7 15 and i just got back from going to the storeroom because we needed some items and my train's still not here, so hopefully she's still not here when I get in there. But.